Hello students, today I will show you how to read data from keyboard in Java. There are three different ways uh, or three different main ways to read data from keyboard in Java. So first is using input stream reader class. Input stream reader class can be used to read data from the keyboard. It actually performs two tasks. What does it do? It connects the input stream of keyboard. So it connects input stream of keyboard and convert the byte oriented stream into con character oriented stream. So if the byte oriented stream to character oriented stream. So now let's see an example how you can use this. Uh, in the stream input stream reader class you have to use buffer reader class which is used to read the data line by line using read line method. So the structure I have already created. First you have to create an object of st input stream reader. So let's create this. Input stream reader. Suppose IR is equals to new input stream reader and you have to pass the system dot in console so system dot in, in console we have studied in, studied in the introduction of file io uh, which is one of the three types of stream that you are using so use system dot in as the input now create an object of buffered reader class so use buffered reader br is equals to new buffered reader and attach this input stream object ir with this so if we are now if you have to read this uh, read anything that is input from the keyboard you can use read line method so br dot read line this method is used to read the contents line by line so this is this and there are other methods available also which you can read from the documentation of java next type is using console or using console class so console class can also be used to read input from user the main difference between all the three is that console class can read text and password so it provide methods to read text and password iska kya matlab hai ki agar aap password read kar rahe ho console se using the particular method then the output is not displayed to the user ki jo password type ka method hoga wo display nahi hoga to ek example dekhte hain sir kaise likhte hain hum isme so structure is already created here now create an object of console class so console c is equals to new console and to read text you have to just use c dot read line method it is used to read text value which is actually displayed to the end user now if i have to read a password then i have to use c dot read password method so this password is now not displayed to the user this is the main difference of using console class that you can use specific method to read passwords in a hidden form next is using scanner class scanner class has is already been covered by me in the earlier lectures of java uh, scanner class is in is a very important class and it is present in the util package of java using scanner class you can read character integer and float double 
with these methods there are many methods of using scanner class like string next it is used to return the next token from scanner next line it moves the scanner position to the next line and returns the value as a string next byte next short next int it is used to return a int value long float and double so there are many methods available in the scanner class that you can use to read the scanner class uh, to read more about the scanner class you can refer my video of how to take input from user using scanner class in the earlier lectures so this these are the three different ways of using uh, or these are the three different ways of reading data from keyboard in java thank you for watching the video please subscribe to the youtube channel for more tutorials